Okay traders, it's going to show you how the first target has been hit and then what the process is for this indicator when we're hedging against our options. So as you know, like it wasn't 20 minutes ago I was doing an update as this trade was triggering. That's triggered in, it hit 80% so we move our stop to break even which is there. And then we've hit target 1. So we've got two contracts off at target 1. So I'll just do this and uh, fill out the spreadsheet so you know how it works. So it's the 4th of May, 3.36 is when it triggered. Uh, so it's 4th of May, 3.26. It's short from 11.93.25. Now I'll just check my fill. Yep, that's right, 11.93.25 is what we've got to put in five times. 11.93.25. So we'll just copy that, paste that down five times because there's five contracts on. Now we took two off. We'll copy this as well. Now we've hit target one, which is here, right here. So that is where we take our profit. Now remember, we still want this indicator to hedge our options trade. So all we want to do here is take some of the profit out of the trade and then hedge with our remaining two contracts. So we take two off at 11.88.50. So we put that in, so we, we bank that money. 11.88.5, 11.88.5. So at the moment we take out 4.75 points. Now that should be uh, per E mini, not per large. So we'll just go up like that. And now we're looking for, so we've hit target one. So now we're looking for 80% of target 2, which is there. Now our stop at the moment uh, is at break even. So that becomes our red stop. So we've hit target 1. Now we're looking to take one contract off at target 2, which is down here. But at 80%, we're going to lock in some more profit. So at 80% of this trade, so when this trade gets down to this blue line, which is 80%, we're going to move our remaining, our one, well, so we move one contract to level one to lock in some profit, and we leave the remaining two at break even until this directional takes over the break even part. And then we're going to trail the last two contracts off the directional 2.5 points. Now that becomes our hedge. So then as long, that'll keep going down as long as it stops out, and then we'll take that profit as well and look for the next setup. So that's how this indicator works. So you, you see it in real time. So at the moment, we are still short in this trade, looking for 11.84.50 before we make the move to break even for one contract. And then we're going to leave the rest at break even until the directional catches up. So I'll give you another update as this trade unfolds. But... This is, is a good idea of how it works.